Hey guys, um, I'm going to be showing you a cool new thing I found. Um, if you don't know, the iPad has been able to be controlled by a Bluetooth mouse. Um, I currently don't have a, any type of Bluetooth mouse, keyboard, anything for my iPod or for my computer because my computer doesn't have Bluetooth. Um, but I'm going to show you how you can control your iPod screen with a USB mouse and you're going to need uh, Linux Ubuntu um, this might work with Windows my Windows currently right now is not working um, you're going to need VNC from uh, the or from Cydia you're going to need VNC and also there's this thing called mouse mouse um, you can swap the buttons, change how fast it'll move on your screen. Um, this is for when you uh, can control. This is more mainly for the iPad, but um, again, I don't have Bluetooth and I can't tether. So um, you're going to go to on Ubuntu, Applications, Internet. You're going to go on to Remote Desktop Viewer. Okay, you're going to click this little button right there, and under protocol will be SSH and VNC. Um, under host, you'll type in the IP address that you can get from going to settings. I'm currently using my laptop for internet right now. Wi-Fi, and let me just make sure it is. Um, yeah, it's the same one. Um, I don't really want to show you, but I'll show you the first. 10.42. Um, I'll show you that. You get the rest. Um, just by looking at yours. But that's how to get that. So, um, you need, need those installed. VNC and mouse. My autofocus is not being nice right now. Um, so once you have those installed, you are going to want to go back to the computer and under VNC, you're going to type in, under host, you're going to type in the, uh, whatever yours, uh, your IP address is. Click full screen. Um, none of this other stuff really matters. And just, let me log in. Okay. Um, then you're going to click connect. You'll get a screen like this. It'll be black. And you have the little mouse. And then it'll say accept access request and then your IP will be underneath of it. And then that stuff, all you do is click accept. And guess what? See that right there? It's a mouse. Go to the screen. Go to here. It's a, it's a little laggy because um, it's using my uh, Wi-Fi that my computer has. But yeah, here's the mouse. Just move the mouse around. Um, the scrolling and stuff to other pages is a little choppy, and it let the mouse is um, just not the greatest thing right now. Pretty much at the ballpark, getting over as far as you can, and then letting go. Ooh, it is really lagging up right now. There we go. Okay. And you move over. <laughs> yeah, this is being real bad right now. Sorry about this. It was working fine a little bit ago. So let's just move it there. Get the mouse back in focus. Okay. Um. Hmm, there we go. There we go. Oop. Kind of hard to. Or it's kind of easy to lose. So, and you can also click the um, right mouse button. It'll bring you back to the home screen, and you can click the scroll button 
and it'll turn it off. So you still got it. Um, I don't know if they're ever going to improve upon this and make it better, but uh, this is me showing you controlling iPod with a mouse. This is just a USB mouse connecting to the side right there on my laptop. And yeah, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe. Um, I might build upon this. There are other stuff. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.